The new placement tools in Cinema 4D S24 take your set dressing workflows to the next level. The Place tool allows you to easily place objects on any surface. It can be used on existing objects, as well as to create and place objects directly from the new Asset Browser. You can easily move, scale and rotate objects without switching to another tool. If you want to copy an object, just hold down Ctrl on a PC or Command on a Mac while you drag the object. This speeds up the process of populating a scene with objects a lot, and you can even define if you want to create instances or full copies. You can also adjust the up direction of the object you want to place, which is quite useful when you want to place objects on a wall or ceiling. The Place tool comes with bounding box-based collision detection to make sure placed objects won't intersect. The new scatter pan allows you to paint a single object or multiple objects onto surfaces. By adjusting the parameters, you can paint everything from random distributions to clearly defined strokes. If you painted objects in a place where they shouldn't be, just use Remove mode to erase the objects. You can choose to paint objects from an existing object selection or a predefined object palette. Object palette mode even allows you to define the frequency for each object. You can also adjust the alignment of objects, for example if you want them to point straight up. Or randomize transform parameters to add even more variation to your scenes. In the Scatter object, you can activate Edit mode and adjust transformations for each object separately, for example by using the Place tool. The new Dynamic Place tool allows you to place objects with dynamic simulation. You can move, spread and rotate objects in a single tool and they will automatically collide with other objects in your scene. Last but not least, you can even trigger dynamic simulation with gravity simply by holding down shift while dragging.